Hey, welcome back to Homegrown Country Home Place, friends. How y'all doing today? Well, y'all, I've been out here in my leather shop day working. And I just want to bring y'all along, show you what I was working on there. Um, I didn't, you know, show you a video of me making this because it's the first time, you know, I've done one of these. And I just wanted to uh, kind of walk through it myself there and see how it, you know, turned out and everything. Um, you remember the other day I told you, you know, I bought some zippers. And I thought about, you know, making something, you know, a project, you know. And so this is what I came up with right here, just a real simple leather uh, coin pouch, or it could be used as like a, you know, I guess an organizer, put coupons in, or just whatever you want to do there. Or I guess a man could take it and use it as a, a some kind of pouch or a billfold, you know, stick in his pocket, you know, put something in it, you know. The, you know, it's, it's endless what you use this type of stuff for. But I, I think it looks real nice, y'all. It's something that, you know, you know, uh, it's just well, it's real compact. It's only like three and a half inches wide, six inches long, and I put this brass zipper in it. And um, there's the back side of it right there. And the uh, leather I made out of just you know vegetable tan leather for. Let me see. Now this this particular uh, one is made out of um, six to seven ounce leather, so it's, it's a little bit heavier leather. Then, you know, while probably making the next ones out of, uh, I've ordered me some four to five ounce leather to uh, do some more and maybe put some, you know, outside, like a pocket or something, make them a little bit smaller. I'm just going to try to, you know, make different ones and stuff like that, you know, because you never know what somebody's going to be wanting. So I'm just going to kind of change it up there a little bit, you know, different design. Like on a, a coin purse, it'd probably a little bit shorter, you know, won't be the six inches in length but um anyway just design a little bit different you know but this leather here uh the reason i use this particular weight on this thing is because that's what i had and you see the edges that right there i burnished the edges i, I kind of i just left them natural y'all and uh just burnished them and uh, it looks real nice and the uh, thread i'm using is a uh just a white um nylon thread I can't remember the number on it. I think it was 345, 346, something like that right there. But uh, the zipper, like I say, it's just a brass zipper and it's got a dark brown. Um, and here's the inside. Well, I don't know if y'all can see that in there or not, but uh, let me turn it right there. It's the dark brown dye. And then I took some tan coat and, you know, finished over the top of it, make it, you know, smooth. Um, and the outside of y'all, um, what I did, I just used a light tan, uh, dye, and then I came back and, um, it had a, a couple of little specks on it. I didn't, I didn't like, you know, the, in, on, on the finish, I didn't like it. So what I did, it took me some, uh, light sandpaper and I went across it and sanded it. And then I came back with some dark walnut and I put across it real quick and rubbed it off. And uh, came back and sanded it real light there. So what it did, it gave it a distressed type look right here. I don't know if y'all can pick up on that. But uh, I like the way it turned out. And uh, you can see back here, you can see subtle changes in the color and stuff back here with that light and dark walnut stain. And uh, I like the way that turned out. And uh, on the uh, finish of it, uh, I didn't put no resling uh, on it, or I didn't put no tan coat. And what I did, I just used that uh, beeswax and neat's foot oil uh, wax I made up the other day. And I just polished it real good and uh, just buffed it off and let it soak in there good and I buffed it off. And it, I, I, like, I like the way this uh, finish turned out. It looks, uh, gives like a little matte shine to it. But it's also got that, you know, nice distressed look to it. So um happy way it turned out. I just want to bring y'all along and um, show you what I was working on today. And uh, what I've done, I've ordered me some more leather, uh, some four to five ounce of vegetable tan leather that I'm going to make some more out of because I, I didn't, uh, I think this right here is fine, you know, especially if you want something real heavy to you and everything. But um, it makes it a little bit stiffer when you open it up with the, uh, six to seven ounce leather but it's definitely um good and heavy duty and this actually could be used if i uh, say somebody wanted a 
wallet, you know, man, I guess, you know, if he wants to throw his cash in there and throw, you know, this fits perfectly down into your back pocket right there. And, uh, but the intent was making something, say, you know, a woman, something wanted a corn pouch, something like that. That's the intent behind making this just a real simple design. And the ones I'm making in the future, I'm going to, you know, you know, mix it up a little bit. I'm still going to make some like this, and I'm going to make some that's going to have, uh, say, a pocket out here on the outside, say, for cards and stuff. And then I'm going to probably make some with a divider on the inside here, on the inside here. And uh, so uh, just give, try different things there. Just, you know, like I say, you, that thing with the leather, y'all, y'all can, you can change it up any way you want to, you can add to. And like I say, on the smaller ones, like the little coin purses, it's going to, you know, pouch, it's going to be a little bit smaller than this. I'll probably put me a, um, uh, like a ring or leather uh, latch on the, uh, something where that, you know, you're going to hook, say, to your key ring, something like that on the smaller ones. This uh, particular one right here, you know, I didn't do that because I made it on a larger size. And uh, anyway, y'all, I just want to bring y'all along today, show show you what I was uh, working on. Uh, I've been working on some different things, some uh, key rings and stuff, and uh, just whatever uh, comes to mind that particular day, different styles and stuff like that. Uh, that's what I do, y'all. Just whatever. Um, uh that day tomorrow y'all probably be uh might be making knife sheets again so i just kind of mix it all up there and that way i won't you know get bored doing just one thing over and over and over and um i just like try to make different things and learn new things and um eventually like i say all this stuff i'm making here i'll be taking to sell so uh it's gonna give the you know me you know options for out there my take them to sell different people you know they're going to see different things you know that i make it's not going to be on like say one thing it's not going to be a you know, wide variety of things but anyway y'all hope y'all uh, enjoyed the video i just want to show y'all what i was working on today and uh if you got any comments any suggestions anything uh just leave, leave it down there in the, uh, in the comment section there i appreciate it and if y'all like this video, y'all, give me a thumbs up. As always, friends, my family years, y'all have a blessed day. We'll see you later. All right. Bye-bye.